Hey guys, Edward Scissorhands Anthony here. Um, today we're going to go over something that is uh, a basic move. We're going to do an arm bar from side control. Um, but this is one of my pet peeves in Jiu Jitsu land. Okay, so we're going to go over how I prefer to do arm bars from side control. And uh, we're going to go over a few specific little details. Okay, so I'm going to start up here in side control. All right, now I like to get a cup here on his shoulder. Okay, so I like to have my hand curled around his shoulder here so I can pull him up onto his side. All right, I always like to turn my arm in and put pressure into his ribs. Now, what I see all the time, that's my pet peeve, is I see these people putting their hand here and they step their foot on the ground here and make all this space. Okay, this is what we're trying to avoid. So I come here, I grab the shoulder, Pull him up onto his side, putting pressure in. Now my hand comes here, and I'm going to lift my leg over and around. Okay, you see how my knee's towards the belt here. Okay, now, as I sit back, I squeeze my knee up. You see how now he's propped up on his side. This gives me a lot of room to break the arm. All right, so I control his arm, come down, push up. All right. Because his body's up on the side, I have lots of space to do that, okay? I have lots of breaking potential, all right? If we're just flat on the ground, obviously there's only so much space I have to move my hips in order to manipulate this joint, okay? So let's do that again. Side control, control the shoulder, pull him up onto his side, and here, Swipe the leg around, my knee to the belt. Look, my leg's not touching the floor. Set, squeeze my knee up. Slowly go back, get the tap. Okay, this is something to work on. It's not as easy as it looks. Key things to focus on, bringing the knee all the way down to the belt and squeezing the knees together as you go back. Hope you enjoy the technique this week, guys.